Hello everyone, and welcome back to the walkthrough. Quick little note about ye ol' sandy galaxy type place, you know, the sand bird. Well, that particular version is actually called the Sand Sailor, so yeah, anyway. <laughs> Uh, oh wait, that's right, I've got to go... No, 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 here. Shiverburn Galaxies Prankster Comets. And it's namely just like a clear out the place sort of thing, if I recall correctly. I remember this one at least. Octo Army Icy Rainbow Romp! That is a mouthful. <laughs> yeah, just clear out all the critters. I probably am better off... Oh, look at that shadow weirdness going on. <laughs> Playing on the actual console, folks. But yeah, I think um, I'm gonna go from the front to the back if I can help it, because the uh, the whole thing about it is I, I think the camera's gonna be in my way otherwise. So I'm just gonna go kind of kind of zigzag thusly, <laughs> just going from the front to back there, collecting star bits whenever I have the opportunity to. Maybe maybe a few. Rainbow Star re-pickups here and there, but my main focus is, of course, going to be to kill the Octumba variations here. There you go, and also, you know, you gotta, gotta keep the rainbow going, too. Taste the rainbow. I win! <laughs> but yeah, the, uh, the whole thing about it is that you can't just, like, run yourself into an enemy either, because that's gonna, that's gonna cause you ire as well, so... <laughs> Anyway, let's not fall off the edge or anything like that, and just kind of flip-flop over here safely, and there we go. <laughs> yeah, that was nice and quick. Woo! Maybe I should have saved that for a filler time or something, I don't know. <laughs> well, it's done now. I'm sure there'll be more comets in the future for me to use as filler time. <laughs> Galaxy 100%! Well, Silver Crown. <laughs> and now, I think I'm gonna go from top to bottom, left to right. That's, that's the best, best way that I can think about it from here on out. Boo Boo Moon Galaxy. And there's a really diabolical secret star here, if I recall correctly. Silver Stars pop up! Oh boy, the snake blocks. Oh boy, the snake blocks. But yeah, there's these pop-up book type things. You'll you'll see when we get into it. But man, this planet is pitch black. Jeez. Hey, it's Luigi. You know you're you're probably the best man for the job. I've seen you in Luigi's mansion. You you went through that place with nerves of steel. No fear in you whatsoever. So it's Luigi time. It's tough to light there, I suppose. But hmm, hmm, hmm. Oh man, what the? What is? What? What? This can't be. Are we, are, we, are we trapped? How could this be? There's, there's no way. Well, there's all sorts of secret stuff to go around here. You gotta kind of take a look, see around. And what? I thought. That I thought the hmm. Uh, what? Uh, well, there is secret stuff. I'm pretty sure. <laughs> There's booze that you can knock through the walls, and yeah, how did I miss that opening before there? That would, that was just dumb. I don't know. <laughs> but yeah, if a boo's in your way on these hallways, just just spin, get them out of your way. There you go. I have a good time. You don't even have to worry about them being directly behind you or something like that. <laughs> uh oh, Jack o Goombas. We know how to deal with these bad boys because they're they're pretty imper. Oh shoot! You just had to drop your fire, didn't you? Just had to drop your fire. <laughs> oh shoot, that's not go- well, mm. uh, oh, 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 this is not looking good. <laughs> uh, probably gonna, probably better off just getting the coins at this point, just to recover my health. Oh yeah, well, <laughs> should not make mistakes if you want to get the powers, some bonuses, stuff, and woo! Well, this isn't the time there's a secret there, I guess. <laughs> I'm thinking of something else, so, sick blocks. Oh man, snake blocks. Across death poison. Oh man, they're just going all over the place at high speed. Leading us, of course, through the Octo Booze, because you know, they, you think that they'd want to take you to a safer area, but no. No, of course not. 
Alright, so be on the lookout for Comet Metal coming up, if I recall correctly. I don't think I should have hit that at the moment in time that I did, because, I, yeah. Well, oh, okay, I made it. <laughs> we're good, we're good. And grab those one-offs waiting for the snake blocks to kind of loop around here and do their own thing. They just, they just do what they want, man. <laughs> and now, like, snake blocks. Oh, jeez, I didn't know the swamp could do that. That is just craziness. That's totally, totally bonkers. Oh, boy. Okay, so now we're flipping it around. Now we're going to get... Awkward control territory ish. There's our comet metal. Yeehaw! Oh. Oh. The powers of a star. And this is much easier with Luigi than it is than it is with Mario, by the way. <laughs> so maybe I took the easier character of the two, but the powers of the star compel you, I tell you. Oops. Whoopsie doodle. Go, 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 go. Okay, that'll do. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, I just got a whole load of star bits before I even am going to be climbing up the structure. See, this is this, is this uh, thing here at the end, and there's silver stars around these parts. Well, well, of course, there is a tr there's a little trick to this. Whoop, hit that, it's a pop-up book. <laughs> so now we got to kind of get up there and get as many of these as we can before our time runs out. Well, am I gonna be able to hit it? Ah, oh, man. Oh, man. Hold on a sec. Oops. No, 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 no. I wanna go and do some fancy backflipness. Ah, I didn't think you could do it. <laughs> Gotta wait for it to pop back up again. Yeah, once you hit the switch, you don't have to hit it again. It just, it just goes up and down at regular intervals. I wanted to be super efficient, though. But alas. Alas, it ain't gonna happen, I guess. <laughs> Uh, I still want the rest of these star bits. You can go up there, of course, but, you know, it's not really necessary unless you want that one up. <laughs> Woo! Now, I believe that the secret star is not in this one, but it's in another one. We'll see. I think it's going to be highlighted by a question mark, so I'll know for sure once I go back over there after I clear a star and whatnot. So, yeah. Ghost appears. Happy days. <laughs> And oh oh. Uh oh, there's our filler comet. <laughs> Actually, I think that's gonna take me a little longer than a, than a filler, probably. Uh oh, Luigi's got a letter. What? What? New dialogue, too, so I should actually read it. Luigi, I have a letter, letter for you! <laughs> Help one in. I've got a few odds and ends I need to take care of. If you don't mind a little hard work, come find me. I'm working over in Space Storm Galaxy. I'll make it worth your while. So we got two things unlocked now. But now, you know, we're kind of kind of preoccupied with a certain ghostly galaxy anyway, so... Let's just... Well, leave them for filler then. <laughs> just just keep things nice and organized. Don't look that toad, the male toad directly in the eye. Just move on. Move on. Boo Moon, go! <laughs> and let's see here. Now, haunting the Howling Tower! No secret star marking in sight! Whoa, the Boo Mushroom, so spooky! Actually, it's incredibly handy! Okay, I think this is the part yes. where we're gonna have all sorts of secret passages on this. I guess you could say Haunted M Mansion Planet. Oh, that's maybe what happened before. I passed by the wall... Yeah, and then I thought, oh, that it was closed, but it was actually an automatically opening wall. So that's maybe what I what I flubbed that before when I thought, oh, I passed by a wall and it was open, but it actually wasn't open. Maybe. And you also notice that the layout here just seems a little different, doesn't it? Well, anyway. <laughs> So yeah, there's there's indeed some differences going on over here. Uh, that's just kind of smushed. Oh shoot, that's not conductive to victory. Nor is the little bits of fire you're leaving behind. Uh, that was much much more efficient. Oh, except for this. <laughs> and star bits for the win. I think I got them all. Yeah. <laughs> all right, let's continue. Out of my way, suckers. 
Uh, oh, jeez. <laughs> it just came right back. You don't, you don't listen to me whatsoever. Wait, wasn't there a second path over here that I wanted... I probably want to explore a little bit? No, no, maybe not. No, I guess not. Okay, everything is locked up. <laughs> going, going around you go. Uh-oh. Uh Bowser Jr. statue in this path. What could that mean? What could that mean? Well, maybe they worship Bowser Jr. Oh man, boo painting. What could that mean? What could that mean? Well, maybe they're just painting pictures of themselves. I don't know. <laughs> just, just speculating here. You'd have to ask the boos yourself. Just, yeah, oh jeez. Maybe they've got paintings of lives because they miss their old lives of being alive. Who knows? Who knows? I don't know. I mean, I think if they were ghosts and they could stay ghosts for as long as they please, that, that's okay. It's just, like every, every, no problem right there. Just keep on going for as long as you please. <laughs> so I don't know what's there to miss. Uh, <laughs> maybe because you can't touch things like you normally could before. Anyway, I'm just trying to explore every nook and cranny here because there are indeed one-ups and stuff like that floating around these parts. So yeah, I just want to make sure that I show you all the alternate paths and stuff like that. Oh, I was been there. I was in that corner before. That's okay though. We're still good. <laughs> So we're going around, we're trying to find the mystery of the mansion solution. There's our solution for, for progress. <laughs> Just touch the walls, we want to go through them. If they look like they might be a door, yeah. That's why I'm kind of pushing up against the walls as I go to see, like, maybe. Maybe there might be something there that you can open up that's secret. Who knows? All I know is there's nothing to light those torches whatsoever. <laughs> Behold! Boom Mario! Shake the Wii Remote to vanish! That's handy for avoiding stuff and getting through obstacles and stuff like that. Also, mash that jump button to get yourself up in the air! Woohoohoo! Shake to go through obstacles! Tap A to float! There's your other tutorial! Oh man, I can't go through the door! Man, it looks like it's open, but it's actually not. What a tease. What a tease. Spiky hermits, so that I know their name ish. <laughs> uh, it's still not really sure about them. Maybe it's just what I looked up. They're just more like obstacles than anything, as they're pretty much invincible. <laughs> and if you take a hit, you lose your bonus. Observe. Uh, I said observe, not bounce your head against against the ceiling. There we go, see? Yeah, that's why there's boo mushrooms floating around all over, over here in case you lose your boo-ness. But it's not really all that dangerous or anything like that, just as long as you aren't bouncing around like a maniac into things. <laughs> um, I'll, you take the low road, I'll take the high road. You take the high road, I'll take the low road. Uh, actually, what's on this low road now? Another boo mushroom, of course, I guess. I guess it's necessary for this floaty segments? Why did you give me that tutorial again? We've been through this a bunch of times, man. Uh, going against the flow for the one up, because why not? I can't unfortunately go into the fan though, unfortunately. But man, their one up worship continues even in this particular segment of the mansion. And we can hear, oh shoot, ah, oh, I was too reckless. I was too reckless, and now, I can't make progress without going back, <laughs> but there's probably a boom mushroom nearby for oops nearby for us. Oh, look at that! There is indeed. <laughs> All right, so let's not mess up this time. I'm I am not even gonna grab that coin down there. I don't think I'll really need it. I'm feeling confident this time around. <laughs> Yeah, you can hear the twinkling going on here, so that means there's a something golden afoot coming. And I think you know what it be. Oh, shoot. Uh, careful, careful, careful. Be more careful, PK Gam. I said be more careful. <laughs> That's okay. It's getting a little tight here, so confidence has been shattered. Oh, shoot. That was terrible. <laughs> I might actually want to go back for that coin now, but, well, let's see what I can do, I suppose. I'll, I'll risk it, I guess, for the sake of walkthrough speed. I'm just gonna go and try and go through this as quick as I possibly can. There we go, man. Okay, nothing else in that room, I guess. Woohoo! <laughs> 
All right, Secret Star. I don't know if it's going to be marked, though, but it's on that snake block trap type place, and it is it is a really, really cryptic one. It's a nasty one. <laughs> this one took me a while to figure out, but okay. We got the Boo Mushroom, and unlike some other power-ups which were added to our gallery here out of order from the first time we got them, here we go! <laughs> what do we have here? Looks like a soft white mushroom, eh? You know, that stuff you're finding is pretty weird, but I guess that's just the universe we live in, right? Yeah, I guess so. Well, I, actually, I don't know. We're traveling from world to world, so who knows which one we really live in. <laughs> Uh, the things being out of order could perhaps mean that they forgot to actually move things around level-wise, like some things came first while others didn't. See, it's saying question mark there now, but it didn't before. But yeah, it, it just seems like that things come at odd places when they're not first introduced like they usually are. See, it is back at the snake block thing, and I, I have... Uh, uh, my cursor is kind of popping out of existence because I gotta chair in front of me too close with the camera on top of it to talk into as my microphone so yeah I'm just kind of pointing at stuff and then what happens is when it goes behind the chair watch 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 oh it's gone <laughs> well anyway as long as we're back over to this galaxy here hmm all right let's get Luigi to tell us what may or may not be hidden over here maybe this is the the regular hint for finding said super secrets if uh, you aren't looking, I mean if you're looking for it manually as Mario, it's pretty pretty dang difficult to actually find. Whoa, like a pearl! Oh, oh, oh! That was not like a pearl. Oh, but, I, but at the same time, I somehow hit the midpoint and, well... <laughs> um... But considering that I wanted to show the path of Luigi, I'm just gonna... <laughs> I'm just gonna do that and resume back at that checkpoint, I suppose. I'm pretty sure that jump is makeable, but maybe with Luigi. <laughs> Alright, now we got that officially hit, so just keep following the arrows here, although it's kinda... What, what did you just... What did you do that ducking thing there for, Luigi? What, what was that even about? <laughs> Are you trying to burn some time for something by slowing down your movement? I don't know, but somehow you got so much farther than me, and even though this is technically like an auto-scroll thing. But anyway, we're looking for arrows, obviously. Still, because we're still following ye ol' Luigi. So the arrows continue. And they continue upwards. Into a different gravitational field of sorts. <laughs> I guess I'll hit that. Why not? And the arrows continue. Oh man, I think we're getting close to where we need to go. Actually, I think it's at, um, yeah, it's over here. That's where Luigi would be pointing us to. But he goes so fast that we didn't even see with the arrow. So yeah, this thing is still incredibly cryptic. And you know, I've got a slight screen cut up, cut off too, because you know I'm playing on the CRT, which has that little edge cutoff type thing, but yeah, there's our secret star that's super, super cryptic. And it's not, not like there's a really good opportunity to go into first person view either, because you're always on the snake blocks there, you know, you're just, just always constantly avoiding death. <laughs> Alright, I think that is pretty good for a part. So with that, oh wait, actually, what are you what are you saying here? You reminding me of stuff in other galaxies? Uh oh, I see. Hey, you have 77 power stars. How lucky! <laughs> and with that, I'm gonna end off the part here. <laughs> I hope you enjoy, and I'll see you in the next part. We do something. We'll see. <laughs>